Today we are going to look at an accessibility feature on the iPad and to get there we start by tapping settings. The features we're going to look at today are display and text sizes. So there are two places we can find this information. Firstly, if you look at the left hand side of my screen, you can see I'm already on display and brightness. This is where I'm going to start and then I'll take you through the accessibility tab and show you the features there. You can see that you have some options here of whether you would like light or dark mode. Currently my iPad is on light mode and if I tap dark, you can see the changes that it makes. You can then also underneath that, change the brightness of the screen by moving the cursor towards the larger sun or further down, depending on what's best um, for yourself. Night shift will also allow you to change from light to dark mode at a time of your choosing. This might be nice if you find your eyes get tired as the day goes on. Down the bottom we have text size. If I tap in there, you can see that I can now have a cursor where I can change the size of my text. So I can make it smaller by moving the cursor to the left or I can make it larger by moving the cursor to the right. Now you can see that my cursor is at the end of the size that I can go to. However, through going into the accessibility tab, I can make that even bigger. Just before I show you that, however, as you can see under text size, there is bold text and that's simply, you just need to switch that on. At the moment, mine is off. So all I need to do is tap at the side there and it goes green. And then you can see that now all of the text I have is in bold. To turn it off again, we just simply tap the switch. To access accessibility, tap the tab on the left hand side and then tap display and text size on the right hand side. We have bold text, which again we can just turn off, on or off. When we go into larger text, we can then turn on larger accessibility sizes and that then gives us a further menu of being able to increase the size of our text. So you really can adapt it to what is best for you. If you would like to find out more about the accessibility tools, tap on Safari and head to www.xma.co.uk forward slash apple dash accessibility. Here you will find lots of helpful and interesting resources that will allow you to personalise the iPad for all learners.